All right, you guys, quick little note. The restock is actually moved to today. So right as you're watching this video, my store is open. So I had some troubles yesterday with my YouTube video. So it is actually up today and I have all new slimes in my shop and they will all be announced officially in my next restocking video. But yeah, go check it out. Hey, what's up you guys? It's Lily and today we are going to be doing a 100% honest $100 Peachy Baby review. You guys have been wanting it and asking for it, so I'm finally doing it and let's go. Alright, so the first thing that I have bought from Peachy Babies is her unicorn hot chocolate trio. I believe that's what it's called. This slime came with a yellow, pink, and blue slime, and it came with a small bag filled with glitter, foam beads, and all sorts of little goodies, and it was so cute. I literally loved it. It was very nice. There was actually a charm in it, which you'll see in the yellow slime later, which I actually didn't know there was one in there, so I was kind of surprised, but I thought it was so cute, and I loved how she did this. As for the slimes themselves, they were very thick, they were very pokey, pokey, pokeable, I guess that's the word. Um, they had really nice bubble pops. The only issue I had was some of them would tear really easily and then some of them would get sticky really easily. And that can obviously be fixed with lotion or it can be fixed with activator. It's just, it was the fact that how easy it was. And the blue one, I don't know what it smelled like, but they do all smell really good. They have a sort of soapy scent to them, which I don't love. But, you know, it's that's kind of what the scents that we use in slime is for. The yellow slime had the same exact texture. It had a different smell, which I think I like the best. Um, and it had that charm in it. And then we have the pink slime. And I got some more of the glitter in this one to really show that there was some really cute glitters in them. Uh, there were star glitters and iridescent glitters and I thought those were such a cute touch I loved them and the beads definitely matched the slimes perfectly you could see in the yellow slime that one was really sticky so that's kind of why I cut the clips short as well for the pink slime it was sticky as well I did activate these before but they just they just got sticky really quickly and it could have been my lights uh, I don't know this slime, I really loved the scent of. It was, a, I think it was chocolate espresso. Espresso, sorry. Uh, so many people are going to get annoyed by that. Um, I don't know what the scent is, but they all smell really good. I definitely loved this trio, and it was fairly expensive. I kind of wish I had more slime to play with, but that's just a personal preference of mine. Next up, I ordered one of her jelly slimes, and I ordered Moon Jelly, and I really like this slime. It was a very nice texture. It felt basically like a cloud cream, but in a clear slime. It was a little watery. I will say it left this kind of residue on my fingers that I didn't love, but I didn't really mind. It wasn't, you know, it wasn't like a deal breaker for me. This slime was also really weirdly spreadable. And the iridescent glitters were really cute. Next, I ordered Cinnabutter Batter. <laughs> I think I said that right. Uh, it came in a really cute container. I ordered a two ounce of it, and it came with one of the little cinnamon rolls. It smelled exactly like a cinnamon roll, which I loved. And the charm was super cute. It looked just like a cinnamon roll. I actually have this charm. If you watched my underrated and famous slime shop review, I got that one from Artistic Slimes. So I just had more cinnamon rolls all around. This was a really nice butter slime, very soft, smooth, spreadable. It was very self-inflating when I first got it, and I definitely loved the little black glitters because it definitely added that cinnamon roll touch to it. The only thing I didn't really enjoy about the slime is that it did deflate and it wouldn't inflate again. Next we ordered Love Potion and I actually tried to order this like two summers ago when she stocked it, but I was so sad because I was at Costco and I couldn't get it. It was very sad. I actually wanted Cherry Garcia so bad. Uh, I didn't get it to say that I, I, I was very sad. Let's just say that. 
but I did get love potion and I am glad I got love potion honestly it was a um, amazing texture it wasn't really a cloud cream it was that ice cream texture that she talks about it is definitely very soft and sm smell wow okay spreadable i'm sorry um it had the really nice beads in it it was so interesting to feel the beads and the cloud texture together i loved it and the scent was amazing And the last thing that I ordered from her was maple bacon donut. And she said this was bacon scented. I personally did not smell the bacon, but that might have been because she didn't want to overpower it, which totally makes sense. I get that. It smelled like edible cookie dough, though. And if you know me, I love edible cookie dough. Like I made like a huge batch of it and then just ate it because it was like healthy and, you know, food is a thing that exists anyways it smelled amazing and when you get her cloud creams you can't just get a small size like you have to get a big size to really experience the cloud cream you know what i mean like i i've never like felt a cloud cream this way before i just it was amazing i loved it and it had the pink foams in it the jumbo ones and but there weren't too many so it wasn't like a layer of crunch it was just a nice texture and it was super fluffy and puffy and just amazing and clicky and thwacky i just this was probably one of the favorite slimes that i've ever gotten from peachy babies All right, you guys, I know this video was a little bit short, but I really enjoyed all of these Peachy Baby slimes. I know you guys were a little upset at my last video, so I definitely wanted to make it up for it. Um, but I really honestly did love all of these slimes. They were definitely one of my favorites. And I'm not just saying that because of my last video. I'm not just saying that because I like Peachy Babies or Andrea. I just really did enjoy these slimes. Anyways, if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up and make sure to subscribe to me if you want to see more cool restocking videos, challenges, testing videos, reviews, whatever else you want to see from me. And make sure to hit that notification bell so you are notified every single time that I post one of those videos. If you don't know, I am having a giveaway and you can go and follow my Instagram if you want more information on that. Anyways, I love you guys so, so much and I'll see you next week. Bye!